And I've got to tell you, Sam and Candace, it was nothing like I ever dreamed because I never dreamed it would be so dadgum cold <laughs> and we would be outside. But what an amazing day it's been. So I wanted to tell you a few stories. Now, Sam's best man, I could probably tell you a couple stories, but as, as his dad, I could keep you here all night, and I'm not going to do that. <laughs> but I will tell you that he was very, very inquisitive as a boy. He was the poster child for 10,000 questions, and he wanted to discuss 9,999 of the answers in detail. So he was also very imaginative. He was the little boy, the little four-year-old boy that wore Superman pajamas and his red rain boots to church on Sunday morning. We would come down from the communion rails with our hands folded. He would stand on the top step and fly down to the floor. Sunday after Sunday after Sunday. But he's a good guy, and you know, I've known him all of his life. I was there when he was born, and I've been with him every single step of the way, and it's been an amazing trip. So the first time I met Candace was about four years ago, and it was at one of Sam's shows. Sam said, hey, I may have a friend that'll be here, and I want you to meet her. Well, when Candace walked in, I thought, boy, I sure hope that's her. <laughs> and it turned out it was, so she came over and she started talking to me. I was there by myself that night. I forget why Mary Ann wasn't there, but anyway, I was there by myself. And she started talking about boats and being around the lake and water skiing and wakeboarding and air chairing and fried chicken and wow, how important family was. And I thought, wow, you know, this could really work. This, yeah. this could be really cool. She stole our hearts and she never gave them back. When Mary Ann met her, she stole her heart and she has been member of our family almost since the day we met her. So with that being said, yeah. I got to tell you that I love you, Candace, as much as I love my old girl, Sam. I love you more than life itself. You guys are awesome, and I can't wait to see what happens next. So God bless you both. Yeah.